A uh, special greeting to everyone on this, the fifth Sunday of Easter, with this absolutely magnificent gospel. And we uh, start off with our very first reading from the Acts of the Apostles, chapter 9, verses 26 to 31, on this, the fifth Sunday of Easter. Saul as the newly converted Paul makes his entry into the community of the followers of Jesus, whom he had formerly viciously persecuted. As the Holy Spirit had worked so magnificently with Paul, he also was working successfully to build a church in all Judea, Galilee, and Samaria. The Gospel, John chapter 15, verses 1 to 8. This Gospel gives us what we truly need to live the Christian life. The supply chain to receive what we must have to live in Christ comes from God the Father through Jesus to us. Jesus tells us, remain in me as I remain in you. The Christian life only comes through the life of Jesus living in us. I am the vine, you are the branches. Our humanness naturally encourages us to seek life from other sources, sending us into useless and destructive directions. God prunes away all that extraneous growth. Who I am is no longer my body and this world. We glorify the Lord when we, were, when we live solely with Him as a source of our lives. Daily I am being created by the Lord. First John chapter 3, verses 18 to 24. Those who keep his commandments remain in him, and he in them. And the way we know that he remains in us is from the spirit he gave us. Our intimate and deep union with the Lord leads us to live our lives out of the love he has for us. His will is, ne is our never-ending wish and desire, since His will comes out of His love for us. The Holy Spirit enables us to live spiritually, helping us to get infinitely beyond this material world and body that we live in. 